All right, so we're in widgets, which you can import from Blackboard. We're going to do a uh, halving now. So hopefully you've watched the others, and you know that we can do these selects uh, and group buys, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to stick with the same thing I've been doing in some of the others you've watched. We're going to work with the state. So uh, state, and then we're going to count. And we're just going to count all, because I know I'm going to count all the records associated with that from member details, sorry, table, customer. And uh, now I'm going to say group by. State, table customer dot state, right? And that's the one we've always seen. Um, but let's run it right quick just so you can recall what we get. So we get this nice list of how many occur in every state. Now let's say I want to say, well, show me um, every state that I've got more than four records in. Well, now I got to create a filter. Now, we used to use where. We don't use where when we've got a group by. Anytime we've got a group by, we have to use having. So I'm going to say having count of records equal to or greater than, sorry, equal to four. And now I'll only see the ones that have four. So there's my filter, is that having count greater than four. Keep in mind the reason I'm saying count all is just because I, I know that I'm counting all the records. I could have just as easily said count, you know, table cust dot state. Uh, you're going to get exactly the same thing, right? Because we're just counting records, and that's our having.